I'm going to put one of those Rajnikanth. Uh, <laughs> yeah. Give us a cigar. I go. <laughs> hey, welcome back to our stupid directions with Corbin. I'm Rick. You can follow us on Instagram, Twitter for more juicy content. Mm. Thank you to everybody who supports us on Patreon. Follow the Twitter account, subscribe to the like button. And welcome back. Today we're doing a movie review. And sorry we're getting to it late. I was out of town. I didn't get in town till Yesterday. Oh, yeah, basically yesterday. Late yesterday. Yeah. We didn't get to our house until after midnight. On Saturday morning, so, basically. Hitting the ground running. Hitting the ground running. Uh, so that's why we're getting to it now. We will be getting to <sighs> OMG if you are watching this as well. We yeah. will be also getting to OMG 2 uh, tomorrow. Are we getting to uh, Godar? We haven't seen the first one. Yeah. I would like to. I know, because I've had some folks say, because they, they know we're seeing those two, and like, what about Godar? What about... We've been, we've, I feel like you definitely need to see the first one. That's what I've been told. <laughs> and I was you... hoping to get to it before, but yeah. we didn't. So if we can, so, we, we will try. To. But yeah, we will definitely be getting to OMG too. But anyways, doing the uh, movie review of the superstar Rashnikanth film, the new uh, 2023 film, Jailer. Highly anticipated. What is this? It's been two years since he's had a film? Um, what was his last one? What was his last one? I don't remember the last one. I just remember it's been a couple years. Uh, regardless, it's uh, the directed by Nelson. Yes. Uh, who wrote that as well. Composed by Ani. And uh, starring... <laughs> A whole bunch of people. Yeah. But it's a superstar Rajnikanth film in all its uh, celebration glory. Uh, but this will be, we'll do, I don't know, a few days, but we'll do mostly non spoilers. Just it's, Yeah, in it's case new, anybody hasn't seen it. But we will talk about some spoils, but we will tell Early, you quick. before yeah. we get to it, okay? As always, because we let the movie tell the story. Yes. Um, but if you haven't watched it, please go watch it. Come back. This will be a non spoiler. Rick, your initial thoughts of. <laughs> Jailer. That was me doing Rush That was you hands. doing the sound effects. That's very good. Well, <laughs> he has his own he has you, his own sound. Effect. I will you know I will always be and just tell you my honest opinion for various reasons and a lot of people really really don't like me for that. <laughs> um uh I will tell you that if if this is what to uh expect if this is what seeing a Rajnikanth film is like, um I want to see every Rajnikanth <laughs> film ever made. <laughs> this this was way Funnier than I was expecting it to be. Yeah, this is one of the funniest movies I've seen this year. Um, there's nothing but great. This is an entertaining, keeping you engaged the whole time, screaming funny, great action sequences, and John Wick just really needs to ask him how to not work so hard. You really don't have to work so hard, John. <laughs> just just ask, ask the superstar how to get it done, and you can get it done in, like, a fraction of the energy uh, and be way cooler doing it. Yeah, I... Uh, right? Yeah. <laughs> Come on. I, it's, it's, this is great. And this is, this is not our first project. I think this is probably no. our fourth, maybe? Uh, this is our first, first in theater. In theater. Yes. And we, we went to a... Uh, a, a Packed or showing, packed for U.S. Oh, for the U.S. It's, um, it was almost completely it was almost at capacity. Completely full. And uh, there was an earlier showing, but it had like six people. And I was like, this is a Rajkant fan. I would rather the experience. Yeah, we, we sat in the second experience. row. Uh, <laughs> we because were very... We're in the tilt back seats because we wanted to be in a, in a, in a, in a full, full house. And, but it kind of didn't matter because I don't the even... sound is so dang loud. It's, as we know... It's set for Indian cinemas where they're going to be screaming and going ballistic. And the yeah, sound has to be louder than the, the fans. Yeah. But you can't hear the house. Yeah, we, especially from where we were. Uh, it ended, and I got up and turned around, and I went, oh, there's about 200 folks in here. <laughs> had no idea. <laughs> there wasn't. There was probably about 100, I think. Yeah. I think it's probably It was full. Theater. It was full. Uh, but anyways, yeah, I I really enjoyed the f the film uh, as an experience. Um, Just an entertaining the thing, fact, man. And so I want to say something about Superstar Rajakanth, because it's like, he's 70, he's 70 fucking two, right? 72. Mm -hmm. So I'm trying to think, I was like... I was trying to think of like an actor who, if you were still, because he did, this is his own style of cinema. Yeah. Nowhere else can you do what Rajnikanth does mm -mm. in like a film and it work. No. No, because you're, you're like, this is just, you're celebrating Rajnikanth right now. That's what yeah. we're doing. We, yeah. are, we are like, we are in it for the experience the, uh, and that's what we're in it the for. Closest, the closest I can get to it in American cinema in my own personal experience mm. was back in the 80s. With Stallone and Schwarzenegger movies, yeah, where you were expecting the one-liners, you were expecting certain things, but that's still not no, even close yeah. to this. It's like if Clint Eastwood was still making big action films, like yeah, back, did back in the day at whatever how hundred years or old he is. Tom Cruise twenty years from now, yeah, right, and like 
people are just in it for and but Tom Cruise he does his own stunts and that's what everybody right. loves right? right 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 but he doesn't have like cat he doesn't just smile at the camera and people go berserk right and and in that scenario you're like this works yeah and I never and it, under, yeah it does it I does never work. understood like fully I think especially towards the beginning of the channel when people would always especially about Rajagant but there's a couple others but he's he especially when they're like he has such style I yeah mean, what does that have what to does do that with mean? acting right he's an actor what, right what do you what are you talking about <laughs> God, but god damn does the guy have it, style holy the, it, <laughs> again again <laughs> again contextualizing it from our framework mm -hmm. you'd probably have to go back to the days of actors and stars in hollywood here like james cagney humphrey bogart those are actors that yes they were really solid actors but they were known for being who they were in every role and and having a very particular clark gable mm -hmm. they had style mm -hmm. nowhere near <laughs> nowhere near there, there's really i was thinking about this when i was watching them. i was thinking this is somebody who the day because every human being has a day they do their last fill in the blank it happens to every human being this is somebody that you cannot replace no don't even try yeah, there will not be the next Rajnikanth. No. And even uh, we had just watched into the Mass film. If you watch our Master reaction, our movie reaction to Master, uh, Master, we really enjoyed that film. And he has similar in terms of he has great style and he, um, he it's this similar like screen presence. You're doing stuff to for the style of it. You're doing because right. for the cheers and all that kind of stuff. But it's also extremely different than yeah. what Rajnikanth brings to it. Right. Raj, like he. Even someone like Mahanlal in this, yeah. who was who's fantastic, and it was great to see them both on screen together and doing what they're doing. And we'll talk about other people in the in the in the film, um, and that's just it's in the credits. But yeah, uh, there's really we could spend we could spend thirty minutes yeah talking about the uniqueness of what it means to be this particular actor in this particular kind of genre of film because. No one else does it. No one else does and it. And you can't. No one else can do it. No. No, like, you can't. It's capturing lightning in a bottle. It's kind of like people asking questions of anything that really went well at any given time for people. Like, example, the Beatles. Mm. Even Paul would tell you, we just wrote our music and it happened. Yeah. There'll never be another yeah. John, Paul, George, and Ringo. There just won't. Yeah, and, so, uh, and there's so much else I, I enjoyed about this, but uh, right. first well, we of all, it's, it's a Rosh it's, it's, it's his film. film, and he did so well, so and well. I, I, I really just enjoyed all the the shticks, the 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 style, the <laughs> this thing. I was not expecting how bloody it oh. was, and it was glorious. It <laughs> from the. And there was kids in our theater. I was like, "Holy!" There were. Oh, why well, did you bring it is in here. It is a family that, film, I, apparently. Not how we do family yeah, films. Here. <laughs> oh my <laughs> word! You don't oh. tell people chalking people's heads. It was off spectacular. In kids we'll get into the spoilers, but if you haven't seen this thing, it's grotesquely violent. Yeah, and it's glorious. It's great. It's glorious. I wasn't so good. expecting that. I mean, I was like, I was. Like, There's good people die. I've yeah. seen the, the trailer, but. I was like, holy shit. So, <laughs> summation before Stoilers on my end of the things. A great stunt work. A great antagonist. Oh, yeah. He uh, was, he was a, really, really a, nice. Really, really good. A really intriguing story that kept going and had some nice twists and turns. I had that one that I didn't enjoy. I, 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 I thought sound design. At one point, I just sat back and just there's a sequence where I was just enjoying how good sound design was. Some really nice cinematography moments that they didn't even need to do, but they just did to let you know, hey... We know what we're doing on the cinematography side. Yes. All in all, I, I don't know how you can't, if you just go in saying, I'm looking forward to being entertained at the movies, mm -hmm. why you wouldn't walk out of this happy. Yeah. Uh, I, I don't understand how you could. It's so I, fun. And Ani, Ani's music. Even though ridiculously loud, 
Yeah, but so so good. I think I think Rick had a, like a, a I, his jacket over his head. I had I had I I had had earplugs prepared, but they had gotten screwed up in our drawer, and Andrani had tossed them. I was looking for some, but so what I did was I brought my uh, my earphones yeah, that yeah, I wear because yeah, yeah. that'll do a partial block, and that helped. And then when it got crazy loud, I just put my my hoodie sleeves <laughs> up over my ears so I could. But I, yeah, I stayed comfortable. The uh, the music was one in- incredibly uh, fitting for the for the style because that's I mean we'll mention that a billion times <sighs> because that's what you go in for the entertainment of it, um, and it added so much so much to it. You know, like the, this is badass I've, <laughs> in every way. Yeah. He he added re- he added silly music that was as good as any comedy we've seen, and he added great wonderful action music yeah there were great cameos um but some by people that we knew so all in all and guys this is there was also one so good that came up that we did not know who it was uh and so you guys will have to and this is who it is yeah uh we're looking at the name here but uh who it, is clearly a uh, massive 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 star. star and there were things corbin leaned over at one point and he said the reason they're laughing because there were some points where we uh, we could in lower just talking scenes people would laugh and it was seemingly funny but they were laughing a little bit harder and he pointed out wisely so yeah that he's pretty sure those were references to other rajnikanth films yeah and little easter eggs it sucked like we've been doing this f- oh, four plus years now right, right? And we still don't get all the references. No. <laughs> We're just scratching the search of superstar Raj Nakan. I know. And VJ. Um, and Shah Rukh Khan, we're not even like, even though we have a lot no. more of his filmography, there's still stuff that we're never going to get because we didn't grow up you, with Yeah, it. you can't. It's a lifetime of, ex- it's not just, for someone like him, it's not just lifetimes. Multiple lifetimes. It's three generations of lifetimes growing up with him. I mean, yeah. he's old enough to be my dad. Yeah, I guess. Daddy. He is. Yeah, that's weird. Yeah, <laughs> but yeah, that's like if Michael Caine was doing action stuff. Right. I, mean, I think he's like a hundred or something. Like, or Ian know. McKellen. Yeah. Yeah. Like they're just doing going doing at, and everybody's like, yeah, it's bad. Yeah, it's bad. bad old well, you know who's doing? Uh, um, um, taking all that. Oh yeah, yeah. Liam, he's, Neeson. Liam Neeson's trying to do that. Yes, he is. But you'll, uh, sorry, Liam, you'll never be Roger Scott. No. <laughs> uh, but also the uh, you said it, but the the villain in this uh, did so good. Yeah, I think his name. Is... What a great face, man! He was so intriguing. I loved watching, and and clearly, the director knew and was okay. We're gonna just we're gonna keep locked in on that expressive, wonderful face. And there were, I think, this is Van. Vanny Khan, that's him, right? I can't tell from that thumbnail. Okay. He's shape-shifting if that's Vanny him. Vanny Khan, I yeah. think is his name. Uh, he did yeah, great... that is, because it's Varman. My yeah, yeah. goodness, shape-shifting. I think he did, and I, another thing about this is that I think this was a, not only a celebration of the Tamil uh, industry, but all the industries. They had, like, uh, Malayalam references, mm-hmm. and they were talking to Lugu. Yeah, and to Lugu. Lugu. Tamil Hindi. Yeah, yeah. They were talking and, and put it in the subtitles in so many Repeatedly. different languages. Uh, I thought a lot of the comedy really worked. Absolutely, uh, it did. In the, in the first and the second half. Yep. Uh, there was one element that I'll get into the spoils that I just, I was like, I don't think it was needed in the slightest, actually. And, and the ladies. Uh, Very few, but yeah, there were. The mom who was from Bahubali. Yes. Forgive me for not knowing your That's name right off the, the instantly, bat. Instantly, though, you can tell. Oh, the minute I. It's her eyes, man. Yeah, she it's, has very it, expressive eyes. it's those expressive eyes in, in, the, in the Bahubali. And then who is the, um, the actress who is the love interest? Uh, I want to get her name right and pronounce sure it correctly. Is it Tamana Bhatia? She's from Bahubali as well. Man, I'm much. Seeing the music number on the big screen. Yeah. I appreciated her all the more. Yeah, yeah. Just, she she's, a great she's beautiful. She's a grounded actor. I I wish the only I wish she was in it even more yeah, than she yeah, was. I agree. Um so overall there were it's big, it's bombastic, it's mass, it's glorious. Yeah. Uh so just go it's in a blast. and have a great time if you haven't watched it already. Laugh. Um uh, look at the glory that is superstar Rasha Kanth on the screen. Um and and just I, I I think have a great time. I, I I find it hard to believe if you go into this with those expectations, if you're not going to have a great time. Yeah. So uh, we're going to get into some spoils, some other stuff. We're going to talk about the cameos, the uh, other uh, elements. There's yeah. one element that Story I elements. that I just didn't. Okay, so didn't this like. is for everybody who has seen it. Um, now, so, spoilers go away if you haven't. Uh, we'll get into everything else, but the one element that I just I 
I was, I was like, this isn't needed at all, was the twist of the sun. Oh, I, I, really? I didn't. I, you felt that wasn't needed, his son turning? No. Oh, my what, stars. What, what would it have changed if he, if he stayed the same? The moral core of Rajnikanth. Well, you would have still had the moral core if, of, of killing the, uh, the bad guy. No, it's completely different to okay the offing of your son. He okays the offing of his own son. I know. Because it was right a, is more important to him. It was also him. a major downer at the end. <laughs> I didn't think we didn't, so. We didn't say this at the end, but like they immediately, no. spoilers once again, he, he's shot, shot, Rajkant's walking away crying, and they're like, lights up! <laughs> oh, yeah. This, the theater didn't even like slow fade him up. It was just like, hey, I, get out! Our, that theater, we need to, they need to figure it out, because actually for Rocky or Ronnie, the, our lights went up 15 minutes prior. Shut the yeah. front door. Yeah. Really? And I told them at, at the end, I was like, so yeah, I don't know if it's on the timer or what, but... The uh, lights came up 15 minutes, and I didn't want to leave. 15 to... minutes prior to the end. Yeah. That sucks. Yeah, yeah. That's refundable right there. Yeah, right. So, <laughs> anyway, no. Re- no, I, I did not like that oh, element I, of it. I did. I think it could have been much better if it ended on the big acts, big fun. And also, I was just like, it seemed like a weird twist to just have a twist. And I was like, it, he didn't end up doing it. And <laughs> in the end, in terms of, well, he obviously was about to shoot superstar. Uh, superstar. Oh, he was going to kill his dad. Um, but he didn't go through with what he was originally planning to go through. Um, he, he just decided it didn't work. I'm going to kill my dad now so I can continue doing what I'm doing. I just didn't find it needed at all. Oh, I, I think you would have had just as big of an impact. You could probably cut 10 minutes off the film, 15 minutes off the film, and it would have been two hours 30. No, uh, it adds a deeper level of understanding Rajnikanth as a hero and that even flesh and blood... Mm-hmm. Are not as I understand why important I as the universal like truth of right and wrong, and that even his own flesh and blood, were they to betray what is good and right, he will stand on the side of good and right. I loved it. Mm. Yeah, I didn't like that oh. element of it. Uh, other things I did love, though, Mohanlal's entrance. Uh, <laughs> fucking badass. Dude, <laughs> we already know he's a badass. Oh, that was badass. But to hold your own when the screen has been owned for what at that point an hour and a half at least two hours i think it was already, two hours it was more than two hours in here's rajnikanth owning the screen owning the style yeah and you come in and you can hold your own yeah uh, <laughs> but yeah he they made him look really cool they gave his entrance scene once again <laughs> bloody violence and it was glorious <laughs> uh i can't count and rec- I there's gotta be 50 moments that were laugh out loud funny oh yeah and then uh, superstars at the end when he d- went into his his wh- like the first time actually we've seen oh it. first time yeah the that, cigar throw that's the first time I think because all of his films that we've seen up to this point were older before yeah he became larger than life Rajnikanth right and so this is the first time we saw the cigar we've seen flip. the sunglasses yeah we've seen the sunglasses but when he did when he did the the cigar flip Corbin and I threw our hands up we're like yes yeah. we started applauding and then he flips it to the it, other side and it makes the the whoosh, Sound and he defied, you know, uh, gravity and logic, and like he came up, and it was like this spectacular superhero moment. I love the and moment. It was glorious. I love the moment when he's prepping his wife and the daughter, <laughs> saying, "Just stay seated," <laughs> and then they land on his lap. He goes, "Push him off." <laughs> so good. Yeah, there was so many of those, uh, and I think Nelson um, is known for dark comedies. I believe, like in terms well, of like this fits. Um, the like violent and comedic. Yeah, uh, I believe is what he's known for. Um, so you guys can let us know more from him, uh, which we watch obviously, and Superstar Rajka as well. But the other ones that uh, Jackie Shroff looked badass. He oh, had, he had yeah. a very small he, part. He too, I would have loved <laughs> more. It was kind of like when we saw him in um, RRR. It was like, uh, oh yeah, where is he? He was I wa- so I want badass him in this. And then the one that we didn't know of, but I could tell he was this big superstar as well. That we just that we I wish we would have known was um. But yeah, forgive me for mispronouncing this. Uh, Shivaraj Kumar. Have we? And seen why did him? I think that was? I'm being an idiot. What? It was AJ Devgun and Triple R. It wasn't wasn't Jackie. You You weren't even paying attention. (laughs) Erase your comments. I know I was being an idiot. (laughs) Yeah, I just, I I kind of just blew past what you just said, but yeah, you're right. (laughs) Oh, man. I'm trying to see if, like, we've seen him in, like, something older at all, in, like, a supporting role, and we just didn't recognize him. And we lost him, yeah. Um, But, obviously. Oh, you pointed out the sun being rocky. 
Yes. So yeah. the sun. It shows how dumb we are. Like it took me like two and a half hours because I, I was like, I recognize. I just don't know where. It happens all like, the time. I just don't know where. And then it he looks exactly the same as he did in Rocky. And yeah, I was like, it looks exactly. That's the guy from Rocky. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> that we that just happens watch this all the time, as you know, if you've been here for any length of time. But yeah, uh, Sh uh, Sh uh, Raj Kumar. That's a hard name for me to say. Yeah, uh, Shiviraj Kumar. He did really well. He, he had a lot of style as well. Yeah, uh, I liked. Uh, they handled all the cameos. I thought. Shout, shout outs also to the two. They're supporting roles, but they're the consistent comic relief. The guy who's with Rajnikanth all the time. Yeah. Um. And Babu? no, no, no. Well, of course him, but the other guy. Um, oh, the, the the right hand man of the other guy that killed himself at the end. No, no, no. What? The the um, the one the one after they did the the thing with the squibs, and he's pointing the gun at him, and he goes do 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 do. Oh, gotcha. Him, that guy. Gotcha. And then yeah, on the really other well. side of the coin, the actor who plays the movie star's buddy, who yeah. he tells him to get out of the bath and leave. Yeah. He was He's screaming funny. Yeah, I also thought the uh, the the actor that was the the villain's right hand man. Yeah, who wanted did, to kill himself. Yeah, that, I thought he did really had a lot of good comic I, moments as well. I thought it was funny that he was consistently saying, "I believed he would kill himself," but nobody really seemed to give a damn. No. <laughs> but uh, he was he was a hundred percent gonna do it every time. Another element I want to talk about was post interval when I don't know if it was. I'm assuming it was CGI. Oh, yeah, it was well done. In terms of like how they did it in uh, the most recent Star Wars movie of the uh, the general that they brought well, back, right? They did that, and they also did it, apparently, which I haven't seen, in the last Indiana Jones film with Harrison Ford. Oh, okay. But yeah, Roger DeConte is, is de-aged. Yeah, they de-aged As the him, jailer. And he looked great. Uh, <laughs> and I was like, this is a... I love that whole scene. Uh, and once again, incredibly violent. Uh, they cut off a dude's ear. <laughs> oh. oh, man. That's... I love the first beheading also oh, earlier man. on. It caught me off guard. And they like, just, they let him stand there, yeah. bleed out, standing. I assumed they, he was going to kill him, but the, the just beheading. It's so good. I was like, oh my word. So, so good. Uh, it was a but lot. anyway, yes, the de-aging was... I thought he did a great job. Yeah. Great job. I mean, we were on the second row. Yeah. Easy to spot a flaw. Yeah. It was really uh, well done. I think you. I think it was his body and they de-aged his face. because I, I do too. I think I'm sure it was him. His current uh, old man arms. Pretty sure it was him. Um, but I thought that was a lot of fun. And then... The musical number when they say, hey, put that guy in the back. Um... <laughs> <laughs> uh, <laughs> Yeah, there was just so it was just a very enjoyable film outside of that one it, one element didn't ruin it at all. It was just I was like I didn't feel like it was needed at all. You clearly did. And yeah. so whatever you guys let us know your opinion on that element of it. Um I would love to watch every Superstar Rush Gun film. Uh, <laughs> and and by the way, Patreon knows this, but uh, Juju B is one of my favorite songs of the year. <laughs> Yeah, it's, was, it's right was, up there with jamming the with baton. Yeah, it's it's in my workout list. It's one of my favorite favorite songs in a film. It's, you know, it's a great song. Exciting, different director, um, but he's known for Mass Atli, who's directing Jabu. Oh yeah, I'm hoping we get like Mass South Indian film Shabu Khan. Me I think too. That would be a lot of fun. It would be um, to get like superstar Rajdakanth. Yeah, SRK. Yeah, <laughs> I think that'd be a lot of fun. My my last my last thought about what we started with at the beginning, which is just the aura and oh, yeah. and 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 Rajnikanth. Um, obviously, for people who know more about him and have been around him, it's even bigger, right? I want I want so many people to enjoy. I think so many people would enjoy the film. But what do you think would be like for someone, for example, who's never seen any Indian oh. film? Do you how well do you think they could receive? It's tough. Right, and it sucks, doesn't it? Yeah, because you don't know if they'll get it. Right. Like, do you you like you might be able to prep them, but it also if they're not, they're like I, if they've never seen any of them, they're like, what the hell? Why? Right. What the hell is going on? I, Why I, does he keep doing this with his glasses? I think I think <laughs> you would you could a, a film lover. Like say a Valerie, if you just yeah. let her know in advance, this is unlike anything we've got. Think action comedy but there's an aura about this guy the likes of which we've never seen think old school the most cliche kinds of things that say a stallone or a clint eastwood or a, a schwarzenegger did or go back like i said the earlier references and then magnify them a hundredfold mm -hmm. with as cool as you could possibly be yeah i i just i just don't know that you can prep anybody 
we also need to see so many more of his of film, like um, Superstar Rajnikanth films. Because I is, can't imagine you still wouldn't like the movie, though. Yeah. You may miss the enigmatic aura that's him. Yeah. The way others can. Yeah. Maybe not. I, I'd like to know. I, yeah. I'd love to know. I would you love might to... have somebody in the group that when you recommend films. Oh, yeah. Recommend it and see what see yeah, what happens. Yeah, it'd be interesting. There's so many of his films that I, I've wanted to get to for so long, including more recent ones. Um, like there's Pata, and then there's um, um, I'm glad we got to see this one in theaters. Me too. Yeah. Um, uh, Darbar, Darbar and Kala is another one. Yeah. Uh, Kala B. Um, but then he has like older ones. Um, that and the intro. Dun, I'm dun, guessing dun, that dun, intro, dun, that is the, unchanged. The oh, yeah, that's his intro. Uh, that's unchanged since the 70s. And I think there's one of the old school ones that people always recommend. I think it was in the 90s. I, if I see the name, I'll know it. Uh, I think it's a... Oh, Muthu. Isn't that his character name in this? Doesn't his grandson call him that? Does he? Yeah. That might be like... That Sean must be, yeah, that little, must be a little fru- a little wink, wink, nudge, nudge. I don't know. You guys can let us know. But this is, the Muthu is one I've heard a lot about in terms of like, this is one of his, I think the, remember that a, um, Asian guy who was a big superstar Rajkanth fan? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I think he dressed like this guy. Probably this is one so. One of his like Which, most iconic. This though. is a good closing note. Um, we, we understand now from this film that it's very, very important to, to give, as, as, people on YouTube that you you really do need to give good reviews otherwise you're in dire that that moment was so funny it was it was very funny it was so good thanks for the 10 crores that's why this is a positive <laughs> review everybody <laughs> we can't be called just bollywood bootlickers nope. anymore no nope. rajnikanth boot bootlickers oh, now too i don't know what a glorious boot oh we'll lick those uh, boots any day anyways uh, let us know what you thought about the film what should be our next superstar film please <laughs> Please. Film, uh, one, which one would be good for a watch along, maybe? Uh, obviously, I think his, his films lend well to watch along. And yes, Yogi, we didn't talk much about Yogi Babu. He's always great. What, what can we tell you? Yeah, he's always great. He's always great. Uh, so let us anyway. know what you thought about the film <clears throat> down below.